Welcome back to NAZ Today. I'm Sadie Thompson and I will be your sports reporter tonight. We're going to talk about some high school team successes on the diamond and upcoming games for some NAU athletics teams. Let's get started. The Flagstaff boys baseball team is off to a dominant start, sitting undefeated with an overall record of 7-0. This team is so powerful, they have beaten a team this season by 23 runs. The Eagles beat the Holbrook Roadrunners 24-1 earlier this month. The Eagles team is led by a trio of starting pitchers, senior Silas Cleary and Justin Hansen and junior Teague Van Dyke. The Eagles beat Mingus 9-2 on the road yesterday and will host the Marauders tomorrow at 3.45 p.m. The Northland Prep girls softball team is off to a strong start as well, sitting first in the 2A Grand Canyon region with an overall record of 2-0. The Spartans started their season winning their first two games on the road against Sedona Red Rock and Camp Verde High School. The scores were 14-1 and 14-5 respectively. Freshman Dakota Lakin went 3-for-5 with three runs and one RBI, and senior Jaden Dvork finished the game with five RBI. The MPA girls will head to the road for another away game, the Spartans are playing Valley Lutheran on April 6th. The NEU volleyball team is currently competing in the Big Sky Conference Tournament and went into the tournament seated fifth out of eight teams. Weber State was seated first with an overall record of 15-1, and, and the one loss they saw came from the Lumberjacks. The first game the Lumberjacks played in the tournament was against the Sacramento State Hornets at 9.30 this morning. In the regular season, the teams both won a game in the series, so this game really came down to what team wanted it more, and it was the Lumberjacks. NEU swept the number four seed Sac State and are headed to compete in the semifinals tomorrow. The Lumberjacks will either play Weber State or Eastern Washington, depending the results of their game today. Lila Hollis was crowned electric player of the game, finishing with five kills, six digs, and six aces, and breaking the school record for aces in a three-set match. The record has been upheld since 1992. Good luck to these Lumberjacks as they compete in the rest of the Big Sky Tournament. The NEU track and field team will compete in the Stanford Invitational on April 2nd and 3rd. This is the second outdoor meet of the season. The first was the Willie William Classic in Las Vegas about two weeks ago. The NEU track and field team walked away with seven podium finishes in the meet, and the distance and throws team each earned a first place finish. The Big Sky Conference men's outdoor track and field preseason poll results had NAU sitting on top. The men's team took the title in 2018, and the cross-country team just won the NCAA championship. With lots of talent and athletes from the cross-country team, it will take a lot to beat this team. Hopefully, these Lumberjacks can bring the trophy back to Flagstaff and regain the title. That is all I have for sports tonight. Stay tuned for an NAZ Today weather recap after the break.